Are you ready for the heavyweight championship of the world? Are you ready? All right, so next up, I actually think this matchup is a little bit better. And I know what's weird is you started bringing this up before this was even entertained online. Absolutely. And it's um, Bow Wow versus Soldier Boy. And you have that for, I mean, they have it for what date? June 26th. All right, we're not going to wait that long. We might as well talk about it now. Who do you, who do you, who do you got winning? And I guess why? We'll start off with how do you, tell me who you think going to win. We'll do it backwards this time. Okay. Who do you, I think, okay, let's, if we, if we go back, let's go back. Um, I think this would probably be the best matchup. Um, Remember, I know um, Romeo had put out, extended the olive branch to Bow Wow, but that would have been very ugly. Yeah. That would have been an ugly battle. Well, it would have been it would have been decent if they let them do like three rounds, like instead of pick your best three songs, and then it would have been <laughs> Bow Wow. It would have been exactly. It, I, I just it, don't. It, it, I think Bow Wow would have. Bow Wow would have won three zero. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it would have been. It would have been a quicker, a quicker bout. But yeah, yeah so, this one. Um, I, I'm okay with this battle being the fact that um, um, Bow Wow came in when he came in. He ran the airways. He ran 106 in Park. Soldier Boy came in and had one of the biggest songs in. If we're gonna call it, call it rap history. Yeah. Um, the ring, the the downloaded ringtone, and um, that that Soldier Boy. Uh, tell him or crank that. Yep. yep. I've seen uh, he, he, teachers. He has, a, he has a couple of those records to be honest. He does. And it, but I, yeah, I remember that song specifically. That yeah. song came out my very first year when I uh, taught at a middle school. And mm-hmm. the dances, the school dances, or the pep rallies. Crank we, that. Crank that. Yep. Yeah. The, the the school dances or the um, pep rallies we had at the school, and once the DJ played that song, the whole student body actually did the whole, you know, choreographed dance yep. to go with it. Um, so I think this is going to be a good one. I think Soulja Boy has the biggest song between the two. Yeah. Definitely. A, I don't think it's even arguable. He has a couple, he has a couple songs actually yeah. that are just like gigantic. Yeah. And honestly, if, if he walks away with fewer victories, it's still going to skew a couple people's mindset because when he wins his rounds, it's going to be a, a clear domination not Absolutely. just we uh we crank that. I'm trying to think of other ones. Um he had turn my swag. swag on. Yeah, turn my swag on. That's like at every pool party, every party. Yeah. Um, um, and then also he has two errors, like um, so does Bow Wow. Bow Wow, you have little Bow Wow and then you have Bow Wow. Yep. Um uh, I wrote some songs down. I know for Bow Wow, Little Bow Wow has like I put like he has like 10 songs, and then Bow Wow has like five songs. Um, but the soldier boy has like seven songs, and then Big Draco has like five songs you don't even know that's him like it, it, yeah. it's songs that he'll have and i'm like oh i i don't be knowing that's him so yeah um yeah so and make him and make it make it make it clap or yeah clap. yeah yeah and a lot of people was doing the challenge and they didn't know it was him i'm like he say big draco in the song like uh, in the beginning or whatever but he done yeah. trick people into like forgetting like hey if y'all gonna hate on me i'm gonna just like this is my other alias for yeah. Bow. i did this, this, these draco. are just a couple these are a couple of songs that i listed um, for Bow Wow has Let Me Hold You Down, mm-hmm. Shorty Like Mine, yep. Out of My System, Fresh As I'm Is, yep. That's My Name, which is Bow Wow Wow, Yippee Oh Yippee yep. Um, Like You, The One Nine, yep. mm-hmm. All right, um, Bounce With Me, Basketball, Take You Home, Puppy Love, Thank You, um, Ghetto Girls, Then You Got The Features, Hardball, You Got Jumpin' Jumpin', and then JD laced them up nice with remixes. I'm not even going to go into detail with all of those but he's going to include those. So that's 15 songs without me including the remixes. For Soldier Boy, these are just going to be like heavy hitters where if he yeah. plays them, mm-hmm. he's going to he's going to win that round depending on the matchup, but you got Crank That, Kiss yep. Me Through the Phone, yep. Pretty Boy Swag, mm-hmm. Ya, Ya Trick Ya, um, Turn My Swag On, Donk, yep. and it, um, She Make a Clap, and then like four of the records that I'm, yeah. Uh, yeah so it's like, he yeah. may have fewer tracks, but it's the tracks that he yeah. has, they're monumental. So here's the big question with everything that we just named, who do you have winning this? Uh, I think Bow Wow's catalog is going to carry him through. Um, he's going to carry him through it. And he's also a better rapper. 
So for him to jump I, with, on with, with versus though, I don't think that matters, but I agree no, with it. No, it doesn't matter, but like he can he can jump on a song with Destiny's Child as a mm-hmm. kid, but as he's he's actually rapping and how he's projecting his words as a rapper, how his fluidity of how he's rapping. Um, I think that helps as well, along with um uh he has a song with Jagged Edge. I think he's yep. featured on it. The one he's no, it's, on. It, it, it's his. You know, he has one, but he has another one that I believe he's featured on. I think it's him and the brat. Mm-hmm. Um, big song. He did. He did pretty good on that one. He did really well on that one. Um, I just think that he has he has just a little more. He has more depth more songs that he can kind of load up with yeah, he does. in comparison to Soulja Because, you know, Soulja went through a, a time where nobody kind of listened to his music because it got kind of, yep. okay, we don't want to hear that, you know. But um, I, I got Bow Wow with the win. I got it too. I mean, I, I feel like this one is going to be a situation where the person that wins them, well, both of them are going to win because I think both of them are kind of clowned in the industry. Um, but people they forget are. like, Hey, we got some big records. So I think once people see that on screen, mm-hmm. um, they'll it, they'll both kind of gain some um, respect. Um, yeah, yeah. So I, I got Bow Wow. If I have to put a percentage on it, Bow Wow just has a huge catalog to where the songs that Soldier Boy I listed, even if he won all of those rounds, I'm still going 70 30. Um, Bow Wow has 70. Oh, wow. 70 pretty, 30. Yeah, I feel nice. like I don't I don't see a likely situation where he loses this matchup. Okay. Yeah. Um, I think I'm going to, I didn't have it at 70. I had it more again. I'm going back at 60, 40. Mm-hmm. And um, like you said, if, if I go first or let's say if I go second, depending on the song, if I'm trying to, if I'm, if I'm um, big Draco, depends on if I want to try to steal that round or do I throw that round away? You know what I, I mean? Know, yeah, I don't no, know if you it, saw him. I don't know if you saw him in interviews. He's very he got he got he got an arrogance about him to where I think cool. he'll he'll end up playing something that he he has no business playing in that round because he 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 has that much confidence in his catalog. I admire the confidence, but he might be his worst enemy. Oh, so we'll see. So kinda, I think I think it's gonna be entertaining. I think this is going to be one of the most entertaining um verses that we've seen since the a lot of memes are going to come out of this, more so than Teddy Wright. So it's going. This to be is heavy. going to be meme heavy. Yes, like, I'm watching this from do. beginning to end. The, yes, I'm the ready. only thing you're missing, I would have, I would bring in Ray J. <laughs> Who's to say he won't be there? I, I would I, have. I think, that's what I'm saying. I would. Bring I think Ray you might J have in. a lot of ca- cameos. Listen, when when you watch Love and Hip Hop and you got Ray J, Soldier Boy, and um, what's my other boy? Um. So far, when when those three get together, it's always something clown, some Good clown TV. classic stuff going on. So yeah. I would have all four of them, to get, all of them together, and just make it a party because something fun is going to happen. I agree.